Yes, I know it's weird, it's scary. We are back once again with some more MK11. Recently on the channel, or just recently on Twitch live streams, I've just been playing a lot of Genshin Impact, man. I have not stopped playing Genshin Impact for the past week or two, and I just forgot about MK11. I cannot lie. And two weeks straight just playing Genshin Impact, I started missing MK11. I just had to come back, you know, I haven't posted a video in a while, some more MK11. I just had to, man, and I just had to take a break from the game. I cannot lie, playing Genshin Impact for such a long time and looking at Paimon's goddamn juicy cheeks, I, I can't anymore, bro. She is dummy thick. I don't care if she's a kid. Arrest me now, please. Ar where, where are you, FBI? Where are you? Are you listening? Arrest me. I do not care. Paimon is thick as hell. All right, obviously, I'm joking about the Paimon stuff. FBI, please don't come after me. I was joking. You know what? I can't lie, bro. I can't lie. Paimon tell the thing. But, you know, fuck, fuck Genshin Impact, right? We're playing some more MK11 with the man himself, Shao Kahn's bitch, Koto Khan. I don't know what's up with MK11. They made Koto Khan look like the biggest bitch throughout the whole story of MK11. But they make him top tier. I don't understand. They make Koto Khan top tier in this game and they make Shao Kahn the worst character in the game. Hey, I'm not, you know, my son Koto Khan needs some some golden time. He he was he was treated like a bitch throughout the whole story. He deserves to be top tier. But these are the abilities I'm gonna use in these ranked matches. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy and we are back with some more MK11. I'm back, baby. I'm back. Round one.
push in.